Hi guys, I'm Molly. If you've been here before, you will already know who I am. And if you haven't, hi and welcome to my channel. Today's video I am absolutely buzzing about. I'm super, super excited. First of all, check out my background. Am I upgrading or what? It's just a bunting. It's a Halloween bunting. And it's getting me into spirit. And you can totally tell that it is going to be a themed video. So I thought I'd upgrade myself, add a little bit of decoration. I'm loving it, to be honest. Right, I'm just going to get started. Today's video is going to be a Lush Halloween Products 2017 edition. I did one of these last year. I absolutely loved it. I am so excited to talk through these products. Some of them are old, some of them are new. Obviously, the old ones, I will be able to tell you what they're like. The new ones, I'll be able to smell them, tell you what they smell like, and sort of give you a kind of first impressions of them. I'm just doing bath bombs and bubble bars because that's sort of mainly what they bring out around Halloween time. They always bring out the same shower gel, which is Lord of Mithril. I already have some of that. I didn't buy any with this haul, and the bottle just looks really, like, scratchy and vile, so I didn't really want to show it. But Lord of Mithril is amazing. You need to try it if you haven't tried the Zap shower gel. And they've brought out a couple of... Of little other bits as well like soaps um they've brought back a shimmer bar and they've also brought out like a lip balm as well but i'm literally just concentrating on the bath bombs and the bubble bars because they are my absolute favorite of favorites this is the bag and i cannot wait to show you what is in it the first item i'm gonna get digging in i'm gonna go with i've wrote little like notes down here as well just to help me out a little bit um, but I'm going to go with something that I just mentioned um, in a shower gel form. But this is the bath bomb form. This is the Lord of Mithril bath bomb. I mentioned it in last year's video because they bring it out every year and they keep it until Christmas, I believe. And it's literally one of my favourite bath bombs ever. It's amazing. This is the Sexy Beast. It's amazing. It's green on the outside, but when it goes in the bath, it turns into sort of like a red wine, pinky colour. It's amazing. Oh, it smells absolutely sensational. I've missed this smell so, so much. Oh my god, I didn't even smell this in the shop because I was too busy trying to get in and out. Because the lush that I went to, it's really tiny, so I was like trying to get in and out as quick as I could. But oh my god, it's amazing. If you haven't tried it, you need one of these, as I always say. This has a popping candy in it, so literally when it's in the bath, pops really cool um and it has black pepper oil in it vanilla absolute and patchouli oil but it smells absolutely sensational i have dust in my eye bath bomb dust <laughs> sorry it's just absolutely sensational i can't even explain to you what the sort of smell is i wish i could remember what i said last year it's just a little bit limey a little bit lemony a little bit vanilla-y smells very green it's just sensational you need that and that retails at £3.95 as I've said before some people may think that £3.95 for one bath is a little bit extortionate I however do not think that Lush is my life and I cannot have a bath without Lush product so yeah it's totally worth it and how much love and care goes into these no wonder that the price that they are and it's got poppy candy in it it's like an extra ingredient of course you're going to like pay a little bit more the next one is one that was brought out last year so i know exactly what it's like this is the monsters ball bath bomb so this isn't new this is a new one from last year though and this is just really cool and quirky it's a little monster as far as i can remember this is the same sort of color as it is when it goes in the bath oh god mm. it's just citrusy super super citrusy this has lime oil neroli oil and himalayan rock salt in it and it's just yes yeah, super like really limey really zesty really citrusy but super super nice and just hmm sorry i'm just enjoying myself here nothing smells better than lush halloween and christmas products oh my god sorry just getting off on the sense of these this retails at £4.50 for this little guy. The next one we're going to go for is another old day. I think this one was new last year, but I'm not 100%. I might totally be wrong. But this is the pumpkin bath bomb, and this is one of my favourites. Little pumpkin. Hello. 
Oh my God. <sighs> Just zesty, citrusy. This has pimento, berry oil, cinnamon, bark oil, and vanilla absolute in it. It smells really citrusy, cinnamony, just autumn. It just smells like autumn. I probably said that last year, but this just smells like autumn, and it is £4.25. And as far as I remember, it's exactly the same colour in the back. Oh, my God. So, so good. The next one we're going to go for is a new one that we've brought out this year, and I'm super, super excited. It is a jelly bomb, which is a new thing from Lush this year. I have tried a couple of them. They are pretty darn good. They are weird because it's like sort of like slime in the bath kind of, but it's like jelly slime and you can feel it. But oh my God, it's so relaxing. feels really good. And the colors are absolutely fantastic. So I'm loving these jelly bombs at the minute. And this new one is a jelly bomb and it is called Ectoplasm, which I think is so, so cool. And it looks like this. Kind of looks like an alien egg or something. Oh, lime and lemon. Oh, grapefruit oil and tangerine oil. Yeah, really zesty again. A lot of the like autumn Halloweeny ones are always like super, super zesty, but oh my God, so good. I'm going to start sneezing in a minute from all this like bath bomb dust. This is cool. And this retails at £4.95. And I'm super excited because of it being called Act ectoplasm it's the perfect word for it because of it being a jelly bomb it's gonna look like it in the bath it's gonna look like obviously like slime ectoplasm like oh and i'm really excited about what color this is going to be in the bath as well i like bath bombs that surprise me like that they're one color and then in the bath you know like lord of mineral they're one color and then in the bath they're completely different color so that's what excites me this item is a bubble bar and it is the sparkling pumpkin or sparkly pumpkin bubble bar now they have brought out a newer version of this this year this is a lot smaller i'm feeling like it was from last year but it might just be me but they've brought out a pink version and the pink version is called pink pumpkin obviously they didn't have any in stock um when i went and bought all of this and i was too excited to wait to get one so i thought i'd literally just do because it, it looks exactly like this it's a different scent i think it's more of a floral scent and obviously it being pink but either way i need to get it but it's exactly the same still a bubble bar and it's a new one this year which i'm really excited about so yeah but this just smells Oh, just amazing. This has juniper berry oil in it, lime oil and grapefruit oil. So super, super zesty again. Really, really, really good. Can't stop smelling it because I have an issue with smelling lush things. But yeah, this is really, really cute and I love it. And as I said, pink version. We'll pretend it's here. Little pearsies. Then the last item is the Bewitched Bubble Bar, which I've got to say, looks like it's going to be one of my faves. Uh, this retails at £4.25 and if you have watched my video where I've spent like £80 on Lush, yeah I did, if you want to watch that I'll uh, link it below, I went a little bit mad but the reason I went a little bit mad mainly was because a lot of the Lush products were getting discontinued and the Blackberry bath bomb which used to be one of my faves was one of those ones which I'm very sad about and I used it up the other day. This has exactly the same scent so I feel like it's come back to me, its spirit has gone inside a bubble bar and it's coming back to me secretly but in a cute little Halloween one and I am just really excited about this. It looks super cute and yeah I just, I just love it. So yes guys that is all my little bitty bobbies, my tricks and my treats that I have purchased from Lush for Halloween this year. As soon as I've used these, obviously going to buy some more before Halloween comes, but then I'm going to get right on my Christmas. I just love Lush at this time of year. It's my fave. All the scents are amazing. All the colours are amazing. I just get really excited because it's not stuff that you can buy all year round. It's literally just stuff that you can buy at that time of year. And it's nice because like you miss it so much and then when it comes around again you get really really excited and that's what that's what I love most about it really. And I love doing these hauls and I love the fact that I've got a bun too. Sorry, I just keep looking at it because I'm a sad case. But yes, thank you so much for watching guys. Please look out for more. If you've enjoyed this, don't forget to like and subscribe if you can. And I will see you guys again next time for my next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.